Hello everyone, this is your produce guy. Today's episode, I want to talk to you about tangerines. Now these aren't just any tangerine, but these are what I would call a, a legacy or a, an heirloom tangerine. You don't see these in the stores very much. I was at one of our local markets and they had a big display of them there. These tangerines, we used to refer to them as fruit in a bag in the produce department. The fruit is not firmly attached to the skin. There's some, some play in there. Because they come in ununiform sizes, uh, they also come with stems attached. Because if you pull the stem off, you uh, are in great danger of popping a hole in the skin and letting the fruit dry out. So they come in and they're not, they don't lend themselves to stacking those nice little stacks that they like in the modern supermarket today. So you'll find these in your off the beaten path markets is where they're going to be. They are a great little fruit. We're missing out by not having these more readily available to us. High in vitamin C and delicious. Let me show you one of these up close. All right, you're going to see why we called these things fruit in a bag. You can see, look at that, the, the fruit is squishy in there, but it's not because it's rotten or anything. It's because the skin is not firmly attached to the fruit, just barely. Look at that. Now, things pop right out. Can you believe that? That is so easy. Kids can do it very easily. And another wonderful thing about these uh, segments, there are no seeds in any of these. You pop out one segment, kids can eat them, you can eat them, no seeds to worry about. That is beautiful. They make a wonderful juice as well. These things are just terrific. I'm going to open up a few more here and have myself a little feast. Now, if you're lucky enough to find some of these, check with your local produce stands, ranch markets. I found these at a local Hispanic market. Uh, if you're lucky enough to find them, you, what you want to look for when you're picking them out, beautiful orange skin, fresh looking skin, not dried out. You want to be careful of any mold that might be growing on the skin. Or, remember, these stems are really tough. And as these things roll around, they can poke each other. So watch for the poke holes and avoid those. You find, uh, find a fruit with those characteristics, you have got a winner. Thanks so much for being with us. Reminding you, fresh is best. We'll see you next time. Here is that uh, kiwi. I, I went ahead and brushed one up right there, uh, pulled all the fuzziness off. You can actually bite into that and eat it. For, so if you're uh, conscious of the nutritional value, you get a lot of nutrition in the skin of fruit.